collective today. What would the cards like to say? Yeah, you got the universe. <laughs> you got the universe in your hands. This is being on top of the world. You know, completing, completing, getting out of that lower vibrational journey as your baseline, and we're actually stepping into this higher vibrational journey as our baseline. That that's just where we go to. This is our go-to energy. Yeah, being on top of the world, feeling as if you already have everything it is that you ever wanted in your life right here right now today just bring the energy of it here it is the energy that we're asking it after the energy is number one <laughs> you know is number one feeling go for it go for it go for it go after that sun go after the light go as fast as you can towards your happy ever after fairy tale dream of story whatever it is making sure that you know you're not having anybody attached to that happy ever after fairy tale dream of story you can dream you can wonder but don't have them attached to it because if they choose not to choose you you know you need to make sure that you know you're still gonna be okay <laughs> yeah yeah but Cynthia Toa, Miss Flip it, you're Gypsy Mess Woman and your inspirational coach. Ooh, let's see what the cards have to say today. And you, you hear some heavy breathing in the background. I got my doggy with me today. Nay, 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 say hi. Nay, nay, say hi. Oh, yeah, here. Ooh. <laughs> the happy dog. She's happy. She's a happy dog. Happy to get dog hair all in my car. <laughs> Got to clean it up and be Ubering again. I took the day off. Yeah, let's see what the cards have to say today. Ooh, let's see, let's see. They got something to say about that counterpart of yours out there. I know it's got something to say. It's got to have something. Oh, you've been worrying about it. Oh, we got to get out of that worry mindset. That worry doesn't do us any good. No, 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 it doesn't. You know, they're doing your thing, their thing. You're doing your thing. Yeah. Oh, what else going on? Things are getting ready to change, though. Something's changing. Something's changing. So something's changing. That's changing to the better, of course, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> My dog, she's getting all excited about this change. It's getting ready to happen. <laughs> she's going, all right, we got some movement going. Yeah, we're ready for some movement. <laughs> we're tired of this same old, <laughs> old story. Yeah. <laughs> we're looking for that sun. This is what we're waiting for, that sun to shine. This is the happiest card in the whole deck. The happiest card. That's what the change is going to happen. You know, something better is coming in. We're not going to be worrying anymore. No, you're not. You're going to be, you're going to be, you know, full of everything that you ever wanted: joy, happiness, laughter, play, peace, harmony, passion, desire. Yeah, baby, let it be. Let it be. Yeah, it's a little bright out there, so I guess I'll leave these glasses on. Do the reading for you guys today. Yeah, yeah. Hmm, let's see what else is going on for the collective. Yeah, you know, it's like you've been claiming your power. You've been owning up to your emotional self, enjoying the person that you are. You've been filling up, filling your own cup up with your own cup of love. <laughs> with nine cups of love, you got so much love. You're full of so much love, yeah. yeah well, it's nice to be operating from your loving self, you know, because you're choosing who first? You're choosing you first. <laughs> yeah. That's crystal clear. That's the truth. Well, it's it's nice to be able to claim ourselves first. Even though we may want somebody else in our lives that never shows up. But, you know, we decide not to worry about that. We decide to let go of the worry about them never showing up. Yeah, yeah, because we're going to make a change within our own inner being. Yeah, 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 because we truly want that sun in our life right here, right now, today. Whether they show up or not. So, you know, we're claiming our life right now because we're allowing that abundant to be in. Feeling beautiful and feeling amazing, feeling special, feeling Feeling one of a kind, that's the truth. And when we can operate from that higher vibrational feeling just because we flipped our internal script around to this 
that are screwed. We're going to do it. <laughs> We're going to do it. <laughs> forget waiting. Forget, you know, seeing what they're going to do or what they're not going to do. Operate from that strength within. Be that awesome, amazing, beautiful person you are. Allow that sun to shine from within. Allow that shine to shine from within to let it spread outwardly. Everybody will feel it. Everybody will know that you are of a higher vibrational source, a higher vibrational being. They love it too. And they get near you and they go, Woo, what was that? And they put this big old smile on their face. Yeah, they do, they do. It makes them feel pleasurable. <laughs> this is about, you know, this is about a soulmate even coming back together. This, they, these people, they've known each other in the past life. But it's beautiful. It's just like this beautiful journey. This beautiful life, just living from this colorful world. Yeah, colorful. <laughs> yeah, I know. I, I love colors. So, you know, we might as well get the colors in, this, in the picture. Yeah, that is a uh, six of cups is, you know, is bringing something together from the past back to in order. And this is, you know, the, the lion, you know, embracing the lion, having the courage to make those forward movements, having the strength to make those forward movements, to, you know, being, being that strong soul that you really are, being true to yourself no matter what else anybody else is doing even if it is your counterpart <laughs> you know making sure that you're standing strong out there you know there's nothing we don't have to worry about it we don't have to um and think of what's working or what's not working because that's when you know when we're operating from that higher vibrational feeling that's when the universe truly has an offering a brand new offer to offer you that you don't even see because it was never in the vortex to offer it to you until the universe actually does the offering that's when you're ready <laughs> it's lots of yellows in in oranges in my reading here yellow is like the sun and the yellows and oranges represent the sun to me and strength and and um we're operating we're being courageous you know <clears throat> we're letting go of all disappointment and just going right into our happier vibrational way <laughs> what else we got for the collective today what would the cards like to say yeah you got the universe <laughs> you got the universe in your hands this is being on top of the world you know completing completing getting out of that lower vibrational journey as your baseline and we're actually stepping into this higher vibrational journey as our baseline that that's just where we go to this is our go-to energy yeah being on top of the world feeling as if you already have everything it is that you ever wanted in your life right here right now today just bring the energy of it here it is the energy that we're acting after the energy is number one <laughs> you know is number one feeling go for it go for it go for it go after that sun go after the light go as fast as you can towards your happy ever after fairy tale dream of story whatever it is making sure that you know you're not having anybody attached to that happy ever after fairy tale dream of story you can dream you can wonder but don't have them attached to it because if they choose not to choose you you know you need to make sure that you know you're still gonna be okay <laughs> yeah yeah they didn't choose you i know how in the world did they not choose you i don't no, you gotta figure that one out i'm telling you well you know what that's it gave us time to choose ourselves no matter what and says all right bye bye butterflies i'm gonna you know i didn't know that you didn't think you were good enough for me yeah because i know i'm good enough ain't I? yeah isn't that the way it is yeah we, we know that we're already good enough right mm -hmm. right what else the cards had to say for the collective right here today what do we need to know to build up our soul to be you know, living your life as if, you know, it is abundant. You know, that's a lotus that we're laying back in the lotus. Living in life like the universe is taking care of us. Trusting in the universe taking care of us. That we're operating in ease and in peace and in harmony. Yeah, baby. <clears throat> oh, what else? What else? That, that We're just bringing, you know, our... That's, through all the excitement that's going on in the reading, I believe that we're, you know, also bringing calmness within, just accepting the journey for what it is, you know, blending it all together, <clears throat> you know, taking the, um, the excitement and the ease and blending it together so, you know, we're not too, too excited and not too calm, but we kind of like got this balance going on. Mm -hmm universe yeah the universe is all into this picture we got uh, quite a few uh, higher arcana cards going on here that means it's still you know 
Farrakhan is divine, is still leading our show. So divine hasn't gone anywhere. You think divine's gonna leave us behind? No, divine's giving us exactly what it is that we need. Hey, <laughs> giving us the yeah, divine <clears throat> is um, growing us, is expanding us. Anyhow, what else going on for the collector right here today? Yeah, the emperor. Yeah, the emperor's showing up. Mm -hmm. He's been checking out this story all along. He's checking out this journey. He's checking out his Divine Feminine because everything that's come out up until now was a Divine Feminine card. All of them. <laughs> He's been checking her out. He's checking out how his feminine's operating. That Divine Masculine, he is, he is. You know, that's the Emperor. The Emperor is the, and the, <clears throat> <clears throat> he runs the, the, the castle, he, you know, he he takes care of many people, a lot, lots of responsibilities. Now look at this this one. He's got striped socks on, you know, striped orange and black socks. That's interesting. I never noticed that before. And he's holding the big key, you know. He's got the key to this. Hey, I think those socks are mine. Mm -hmm. I think he's got my socks on. Yeah, those orange and black striped socks. Uh, look at look at those socks. Yeah, those, that's something I would wear. I think he's wearing my socks. <laughs> All right, what else we got going on here for the collective right here today? All right, let's see. Mm -hmm. yeah. Give me a card. Well, I've got the highest priest. Highest priest. Oh, yeah. The highest priest knows things that we don't even know. This is like divine. Divine can show us things that we don't even know that's getting ready to happen or getting ready to take place. Or maybe it's already happening. You just don't see it yet. I don't know. But normally I'm reading for the now and the forward moment. I guess sometimes I think, you know, this would be, this is what's gone on in the past. We're taking worry and jumping right into that higher vibrational feeling. So everything else has been about now and the future. So the highest priest, what's the highest priest want to tell its highest priest? Go be that awesome, amazing person that you are. You know, operate as if you had that peacock. Put your peacock outfit on. Now you get to shine. You get to glow. You get to be that awesome, amazing person. You're operating from your higher vibrational self to uh, obtain that happy ever after fairy tale dream of the story. This is getting everything it is that you ever, ever wanted, you ever, ever wished for. Divine's, divine's creating it because you're doing your work. You're doing your mission. You're doing what it is that you've been led here to do. And Divine is seeing it. Mm -hmm. Anything else? Anything else going on? For the collective here. That divine masculine, he, he wants to come forward to tell you how he truly really feels. Yeah. So I would say that emperor, that emperor wants to come forward to tell you how he feels. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It might t it, 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 I saw the tower on the bottom of the deck, and that means he wants to come forward fast. I meant really fast. And he wants to tell you how he feels with the cup of love. That is love. He wants to tell you with so much love. Mm hmm he wants to offer you his love. Yeah. <laughs> See. And he wants to be solid and grounded and secure as he's making that forward movement. That's beautiful. So, you know, when, when we have this ten, of pen, this ten of Pentacles, this, this Ten of Discs, this wealth that comes up, the Divine Masculine as the Emperor wants to come forward to tell you, to tell you how he feels, <clears throat> how he loves you, <clears throat> and he wants to come forward correctly. He wants to be solid and whole and complete as he's making that forward movement to make a will of fortune change, to bring something better happening within our life's journey. That yeah, baby, come on, you can do it. The divine masculine behind the scene wants to come out and tell that divine feminine how he feels, how much he's in love with her. Yeah, baby. <laughs> You're in love with me? <laughs> yeah, let him, let him come forward, being coming forward correctly, you know, grounded, whole, complete. He's got his He's got his act together now. Oh, this is Cynthia Tarrant, Miss Slippy, you're a gypsy madness woman and your inspiration coach here. And I do go live every Monday and Thursday nights at 9.30 p.m. Hop on in and join the other people in the chat. And if you're fortunate enough, you get a reading from Miss Gypsy live on the channel from me to you. Let's see what the cards have to say. And until next time, have a beautiful, awesome, amazing day. Bye-bye, butterflies. Catch you.